And God said, Let there be lights in the vault of the sky to separate the day from the night and let them serve as signs to mark sacred times and days and years. And let them be lights in the vaults of the sky to give light on the earth. And it was so. God made two great lights, the greater light to govern the day and the lesser light to govern the night and also made the stars. God set them in the vault of the sky to give light on the earth, to govern the day and the night, and to separate light from darkness. And God saw that it was good. And there was evening and there was morning, the fourth day. And God said, Let the water teem with living creatures and let birds fly above the earth across the vault of the sky. So God created the great creatures of the sea and every living thing with which the water teems and that moves about in it according to their kind and every winged bird according to its kind. And God saw that it was Good. God blessed them and said, Be fruitful and increase in number, and fill the water in the seas, and let the birds increase on the earth. And there was evening and there was morning, the fifth day. Its gates will never be shut by day, standing always open, because there is no night there. People will bring the glory and wealth of the nations into it. Evil would not enter, nor anyone who does what is abhorrent or deceitful but only those whose names are written in the book of life of the Lamb. Then the angel showed me the river of the water of life, flowing with water clear as crystal, continuously pouring out from the throne of God and the Lamb. The river was flowing in the middle of the street of the city, And on either side of the river was the tree of life, with its twelve kinds of ripe fruit according to each month of the year. The leaves of the tree of life are for the healing of the nations. And every curse will be broken and no longer exist, for the throne of God and of the Lamb will be there in the city. His loving servants will serve him. And they will always see his face and his name will be on their foreheads. Night will be no more. They will never need the light of the sun or a lamp because the Lord God will shine on them and they will reign as kings forever and ever.